sure I put pie no more in my own legacy. What up, came back for you to do what I had. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we have another review for you guys. We are going to be reviewing a classic Korean lover. Just got here fresh from arcade shot, the Young Fanta lover. But we got the low collar version. Let's get into it. Real quick, big giveaway on the way. Once we hit our goal of 300 subscribers, we're gonna be giving away a free copy of Street Fighter 6 on the platform of the winner's choosing. All you have to do is subscribe and comment done down below to enter the giveaway. Turn on the bell notification so you will not miss when we hit that goal. I know what you're wondering. Why did you change clothes? So basically, I filmed all of this uh last week it got through everything literally everything but uh after the intro i accidentally muted my mic so when i went in to edit this video all of my audio was off so let's take two let's get into the lever so we got the Young fanta low collar edition Got it up in my Mad Cats TE2 Plus. Oh, it's really easy to get in. Feels like a nice, balanced, medium tension lever. I feel like I'm delivering a pizza. <laughs> the Krusty Krab Pizza is the pizza absolutely. It's got a pretty light touch, but returns to neutral fairly quick. The Taeyong Fanta is a Korean lever. Korean levers are my preference. I just like the way that they feel uh, with the tension being held with a rubber grommet instead of uh, like a spring and the Japanese sticks. They've returned to neutral so much faster than Japanese sticks. Plus the bat tops just feel a lot better in my hand. Uh, playing games like Tekken. Tekken's my main game, so it definitely just feels a lot more natural and like I have a lot more control over my character. And it comes with a reversible actuator so you can adjust your corners and your area of neutral. Uh, let me open this up so I can show you the reversible actuator. And let me know in the comments if you guys want me to do a full review of this Mad Cat stick. Uh, you can see the actuator here in the middle. I got mine on the bigger side. I prefer a smaller area of neutral uh, and bigger corners. But you can flip it to the smaller side and have the complete opposite effect. It does allow you to adjust to your preference, which is a plus. When compared to the standard high collar Taeyong Fanta, the low collar definitely feels a lot lighter. The low collar is also a lot less touchy than this is, which definitely took some getting used to. This is the stick that I played on the most, so uh, definitely took some adjusting to. I was getting frustrated, dropping combos, thinking uh, that it was the stick. Uh, but honestly, after taking time to get used to the low collar version i actually prefer that a little bit more when comparing the Young low collar lever to something like the knee lever uh the knee lever is a bit softer but the Young lever is way more responsive than the knee lever in my opinion uh, i think that has to do with the switches that they use on the knee lever these were not necessarily my favorite uh, i saw people were saying things about uh like switching out the micro switches and stuff on here which is something that i'll probably do in the future just to try it out but didn't really feel like doing Doing it now so i just got the low collar version of the Young fanta lever which i am very happy that i did this thing is such a solid balanced bang for your buck when you're looking for a korean lever i picked mine up for like 40 bucks on arcade shop which i feel like is definitely a steal for the quality that you're getting i'll link it in the description down below uh, as far as compatibility goes it should fit with most korean and japanese sticks for japanese sticks you will need to get this five pin conversion harness i can link this in the description down below you can also get this in arcade shock as well i think it's like four or five bucks so uh super cheap and super easy to put together now i'm going to switch it over to the trusty hand cam so you guys can see this thing in action
go get this thing. You won't be disappointed. With the price point being at 40 bucks, it's just a nice, easy to use and balanced Korean stick. Now, if you guys found this video helpful at all, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Again, everything will be down in the description below so you guys can pick this up as well. And I'll catch you guys on the next video.